This man is really a talent. In order to solve the problem of home electricity, he used some plastic cover and small motor to create an infinite cycle of hydroelectric device. Not only can drive a household fan and submersible pump, and light up a light bulb are no problem at all. As long as there is water in the dish, it will keep running and will not stop. Prepare a used motor motor and a small submersible pump, and connect the two of them together first. Then find the plastic tire casing from the toy car and seven plastic caps. Coat the surface with glue and stick them tightly, taking care to leave the same gap in the center. Then to the center of the hub eye and out the hole, convenient just to embed this small motor can be, but also need to prepare a separate slightly larger motor, to add it to weld a screw, again, iron through a plastic cover, put in a screw spacer, and install the cover, after clamping and fixing, glue 9 more plastic caps in the same way as before, immediately after cutting 2 square tubes, fixed out of the cross mold, used as a base, also weld a support bar so that it is easier to drive screws in the top to hold the motor firmly in place. Then proceed to wrap this small motor on top of another square tube while welding a wire to the bottom. A thin square tube is installed under the motor to hold the transformer plug. The motor and transformer are then docked and wrapped in insulation tape for protection. The next step is very simple. Just keep the two water wheels in a straight line. Bend the wire at the top to align the plastic cover. And then the submersible pump is put into a hose, tied along the rebar with a tie wrap. And the excess length is cut off finally. Attach the submersible pump to the motor and pour a large bowl of water into it. Take care to put a baffle on each side of the water wheel to prevent the water from splashing outside when turning. At this point, a simple construction of the plastic cover and motor water turbine power generation device is completed. It seems that as long as the idea is not slippery slope, the water will power generation methods. So what do you think of this man's idea?